What is one of your favorite memories from 2022? I'm going to put myself off video because my internet is not great today. Okay. Yeah, favorite memory from, from 2022. I think being able to meet people again without too much restriction. Yeah. Wonderful. That's a great one. Um, what is one thing that most people don't know about you? Uh, so... I'm a set, so in addition to all the things that I do, I'm a certified biomimicry practitioner. Sounds like a weird name, <laughs> but a biomimicry practitioner is someone who studies nature to adapt you know, solutions to human challenges. Yeah. Wow, that is uh, very impressive, and I will consult Google later to read more about that. Um, what is one thing that you're currently trying to make a habit? I'm trying to wake up earlier. You know, can I help to move my body clock forward? But I think, sadly, I'm coming back to Nigeria time, so I'm struggling to make sure I wake up earlier. <laughs> nice, nice. Um, what is something that you saw online recently that made you smile? Hmm, interesting one. Uh, yeah, I saw... I saw this meme for those of us who are like House of Dragon fans, so those who, who watch watch the show. Um, so there was a meme, I'm sorry, this is a long answer. So there's a meme of Daenerys from Game of Thrones that was juxtaposed with the meme of Rhaenyra, where they were both frowning. And it's like a setup for the next season where, you know, you feel like when Daenerys frowned, you know, she ended up burning the whole world. So it's almost like Rhaenyra is about to do the same thing in the next season. Yeah, so that was nice. That was I'm funny. sure all the Game of Thrones people are relating to that. Um, <laughs> what is your most used emoji? Hmm. I think the laugh, the laughing emoji, mostly because I'm always laughing. So yeah, yeah. especially the, the, the laughing with tears emoji. Yeah. <laughs> nice. I use that one a lot too. Um, what would you say are your top three favorite things about living in Nigeria? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, uh, the, the people, very interesting people, very opinionated people. The food, quite peppery and spicy, but I think really cool. Um, and I think the, the opportunities, because I mean, being a developing country, there's still like so much room for, for growth, there's still room for so much development, and I think there's a whole lot to achieve in the country. Yeah, so I think those I love those three. Thank you. Those are great three. Um, and the last question, Wikina, which you can spend I would say two sentences on is what excites you most about your new role at change.org? Yeah. Um, I mean, did, did you like mention that, you know, I, I got a chance to meet every, almost everyone, especially from the Africa team in Kenya. I think the, the culture is really great. Um, the fact that everyone respects, you know, there's this culture of respect and understanding and collaboration and competition, you know, but healthy, healthy competition. I think, I think that's, that, that's really great. I'm also excited that um, this this aligns, you know, with my future aspirations of you know, one day, hopefully, I get to run for office, you know, in the in the future in Nigeria. I think it's good to understand the social challenges before you even get into politics. So I think this is a really good training ground, you know, for that particular role. And yeah, I mean, Team, team Nigeria is fun. You know, there's such a wonderful mix of very interesting people. So <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's also really fun about the team. Nice. Thank you, Nikina. Uh, it has been a joy to meet you last week and a couple times before that. Welcome to the team. We're so excited to have you here. Thank you for Thank you. participating Thank you. in this Q&A. <laughs> Thank you. All right. And I have a great question since the beginning. Uh